Good morning, welcome to the forecast discussion for Wednesday, January 10th, 2018. And we continue our January thaw update with temperatures rising very nicely through the upper 20s and lower 30s throughout much of the region. Notice a few locations are in the mid 20s along the coast. That's where we have our heavier snowpack. Notice, let's say over central and southern Long Island and of course over central and southern New Jersey where that snowpack is around anywhere from 10 to 16 inches. Well, not anymore. It's been going through some melting, and it's really going to melt going forward as temperatures will remain above freezing from, from basically this afternoon all the way on through Friday evening, at the very least, for the entire region. And that is something we haven't seen in quite some time. So certainly that is some great news, especially if you want to get rid of some of this ice and some of the snow. So for today, it's going to be a rather nice day. High pressure is going to be in control. Notice the winds are light and variable. Not much in the way of precipitation is expected. And in our satellite picture, you can see pretty much a cloud-free uh, environment here with high pressure in place. But here we have our next storm that is starting to develop out here over the southern plains and the desert southwest. This low pressure system will intensify as it moves towards the Mississippi River Valley. And on Friday, it's going to bring quite a bit of rain. And then maybe Friday night into Saturday, we're going to have some areas where we're going to see some mix over to snow, especially as you move towards the interior, as the coastal plain is pretty much going to be dealing with a heavy rain event. And some of that heavy rain is going to lead to some localized urban flooding because you have a solid frozen ground and you have a melting snowpack. So you add one to two inches of rain on top of a frozen ground, it's gonna be hard for that uh, topsoil to take in that moisture. And so that's gonna to lead to some potential for some flash flooding and urban flooding throughout the region on Friday into Saturday morning. So let's dive into this forecast. For today, high pressure and control, look for scattered cloud cover, high temperatures in the upper 30s to lower 40s. Tonight, temperatures don't fall all that much, basically bottoming out in the mid 30s. So pretty much that is the influence of our southwesterly wind that's going to be increasing to 10 to 20 miles per hour. Watch out for the potential for some localized dense fog, mostly this warm air moving over the melting snowpack. The wind should limit the fog development, but where it does develop, it has the potential to be rather impressive. For tomorrow afternoon, showers start to develop more towards the evening hour. Look for temperatures to rise into the mid to upper 50s for highs. And on Friday, periods of rain expected heavy at times. Look for lows in the lower to mid 50s, highs in the mid 50s to lower 60s. That's right, 60s. What a change from just a couple of days ago where we were struggling to break 1 degree, 9 degrees for a high. And now we're talking about 61 on Friday. So that is going to be absolutely wonderful, except for the fact that it's going to be raining. Now here's where it's going to get interesting. This low pressure system will be rapidly moving towards the northern mid-Atlantic and should take a track somewhere between the Delaware River Valley and the New Jersey coastline. That pretty much means rain for the coastal plain. But those of you around the Poconos, keep an eye on this storm because that rain has the potential to change over to snow with some accumulation. So that's something that we definitely are going to be watching for. Temperatures on Saturday will be falling throughout the day. Look for high temperatures mostly in the morning hours in the upper 30s to lower 40s and then falling in through the 30s and into the 20s. On Sunday, the low pressure system leaves. Watch out for a few isolated snow showers or flurries with temperatures ranging from the mid-teens for lows and mid-twenties for highs. On Monday, high pressures in control. Look for sky cloud cover, lows in the mid-teens, highs in the upper 20s to lower 30s. On Tuesday, a cold front will move through with a few rain-snow showers. Look for lows in the mid-twenties, highs in the upper 30s to lower 40s. And on Wednesday, high pressure in control. An isolated flurry is possible. Look for lows in the upper teens to lower 20s and highs in the upper 20s to lower 30s. That is your forecast discussion for today. Thank you for following NYNJPA weather, and as always, stay safe out there.